As society's rebellious outliers, motorcycle gangs have long fascinated and alarmed the public. While some perceive them as harmless eccentrics, their dark underbelly often reveals a world marked by crime, violence, and lawlessness. I'm still the president, not him. This video delves into the 10 most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States, exploring their histories, activities, and the threats they pose, providing a glimpse into this perilous underworld. Number one, Hell's Angels. Founded in 1948 in San Bernardino, California, the Hell's Angels Motorcycle Club has evolved to be one of the most feared and notorious motorcycle gangs in the United States. It's impossible to discuss the world of outlaw motorcycle gangs without the mention of the Hell's Angels. Their iconic logo, the Death Head, is a symbol recognized worldwide, and the club's reputation has been solidified through numerous encounters with law enforcement. With over 2,000 members spread across six continents, the Hell's Angels are known for their involvement in illicit activities including drug trafficking, racketeering, extortion, and violent crime. Despite presenting themselves as a group of motorcycle enthusiasts, the Hell's Angels have been declared a criminal organization by the U.S. Department of Justice. Their operation is meticulously organized with a well-defined hierarchy that facilitates criminal activities whilst retaining the veneer of a legitimate club. This structure extends from the club president down to the newest prospects, with each member expected to adhere to strict rules and codes of conduct. Their criminal operations are highly sophisticated and expansive. Drug trafficking is a cornerstone of the Hell's Angels operations, with methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana among their primary products. This illicit business has been linked to numerous violent encounters with rival gangs and law enforcement, adding to their reputation as a dangerous entity. Notable instances of their notorious activities include the infamous 1969 Altamont Free Concert, where a man was killed by a member of the club, and the River Run Riot in 2002 in Laughlin, Nevada, where a violent confrontation with the rival Mongols Motorcycle Club resulted in multiple fatalities and injuries. The club has repeatedly been the focus of major police operations. In 2008, Operation Black Biscuit, undertaken by the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives, ATF, was one of the most significant, leading to the arrest of numerous high-ranking members on charges of racketeering and murder. However, it's not just their criminal activities that make the Hell's Angels a dangerous entity. Their influence extends into the fabric of society itself, they are known to infiltrate and corrupt legitimate businesses, manipulate legal systems, and instill fear in communities. Their strong presence and the fear they instill are part of what makes them a formidable entity, one that law enforcement agencies continue to battle against. In spite of their dangerous reputation, the Hell's Angels continue to hold an alluring appeal for many. Their strength lies not just in their criminal operations, but also in the mystique they have created around the outlaw lifestyle. Despite the danger they represent, the Hell's Angels remain a captivating part of American counterculture. Number 2. Bandidos In the outlaw realm of motorcycle gangs, the Bandidos Motorcycle Club holds a powerful position. With origins in Texas in 1966, the Bandidos have grown to be a menacing presence with an international footprint, infamous for their involvement in numerous criminal activities. The Bandidos are notorious for their rebellious image, characterized by their colors of red and gold and their emblem featuring a Mexican-style bandit. The club prides itself on its flouting of societal norms, living by the mantra, we are the people our parents warned us about. This brazen disregard for conventional rules and regulations translates into their illicit activities, making them one of the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the U.S., the Bandidos operate in a well-structured hierarchy similar to the Hell's Angels, which enables them to conduct extensive criminal operations. Among these, drug trafficking remains the most prominent. The Bandidos have been implicated in large-scale drug operations involving methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana, not only within the U.S., but across international borders. However, the scope of their criminal activities extends beyond drug trafficking. They are also involved in numerous other illegal activities, including extortion, theft, 
and violent crime. The Bandidos have a history of violent confrontations with rival gangs and law enforcement, underlining their status as a threat to public safety. One of the most high-profile incidents involving the Bandidos was the 2015 shootout at the Twin Peaks restaurant in Waco, Texas. This incident, which involved a clash between the Bandidos and the rival Cossacks Motorcycle Club, resulted in nine deaths and 20 injuries, leading to a widespread crackdown on both gangs by law enforcement. Further evidence of the Bandidos' dangerous reputation came in 2016, when several high-ranking members were arrested following an indictment that included charges of racketeering, drug trafficking, and serious crimes of violence. This highlighted the depth of their criminal operations and their threat to society. Like the Hell's Angels, the Bandidos have shown an ability to influence societal structures. They have infiltrated legitimate businesses, manipulated legal systems, and instilled fear in communities where they have a significant presence. This ability to exert influence and instill fear, combined with their criminal activities, underlines the significant danger they pose. In spite of their criminal reputation, the Bandidos continue to attract members drawn to the outlaw image and countercultural lifestyle they represent. This, combined with their extensive criminal operations and the fear they instill, solidifies the Bandidos as one of the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the U.S. Despite ongoing efforts by law enforcement to curb their influence, the Bandidos remain a potent and formidable force. Number 3. Outlaws Motorcycle Club Established in 1935 in McCook, Illinois, the Outlaws Motorcycle Club is one of the oldest motorcycle gangs in the United States. It has established its reputation as a fearsome entity over the years, with widespread involvement in criminal activities and violent confrontations with rival gangs and law enforcement. The club's distinctive logo, a skull and crossed pistons, is a recognized symbol of their notorious identity. Adhering to a strict hierarchy, the outlaws operate in a similar way to other motorcycle gangs, using this structure to facilitate and coordinate their illicit activities effectively. Among the various criminal activities the outlaws are involved in, drug trafficking stands out as the most prominent. The club has been implicated in large-scale drug distribution operations, with marijuana, methamphetamine, and cocaine being the primary substances trafficked. In addition to this, the outlaws have also been involved in other criminal operations, such as weapon trafficking, extortion, and theft. Violent crime has also been a significant aspect of the outlaws' reputation. Notorious for their violent confrontations with rival gangs, they have been involved in numerous incidents that have resulted in fatalities. One of the most notable confrontations was their long-standing feud with the Hells Angels, leading to a number of violent episodes across the country. In 1997, a significant incident involving the outlaws occurred in Charlotte, North Carolina. A shootout with a rival gang resulted in multiple deaths and injuries, leading to a significant law enforcement crackdown on the club. This incident highlighted the violent nature of the club and its potential threat to public safety. The outlaws have also come under the scrutiny of federal authorities numerous times. In 2012, a significant operation led to the arrest and indictment of several high-ranking members of the outlaws on charges of racketeering and drug trafficking, underlining the seriousness of their criminal activities. Yet, the danger presented by the outlaws extends beyond their criminal operations. Like other motorcycle gangs, they wield significant influence over their territories, often infiltrating and corrupting legitimate businesses, manipulating legal systems, and instilling fear in communities. Despite their notorious reputation, the outlaws continue to attract new members drawn to the allure of the outlaw lifestyle they represent. Their resilience and capacity to regroup and continue their operations, even in the face of law enforcement crackdowns, underlines the enduring danger they pose. Thus, the Outlaws Motorcycle Club, with its history of criminal activities, violent confrontations, and influence over societal structures, firmly stands as one of the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. Their endurance, despite attempts to curb their operations, serves as a testament to their formidable nature. Number 4. Pagan's Motorcycle Club 
The Pagan's Motorcycle Club, known for its blue denim cut-off jackets adorned with the club's patches, is another name that invokes apprehension in the annals of motorcycle gangs. Originating in Prince George's County, Maryland in 1959, the Pagans have carved out a reputation for their significant involvement in criminal activities and their propensity for violence. The Pagans' logo is a colorful fire god, dubbed the Norse Rune, adding to their unique and recognizable image. With a structured hierarchy reminiscent of other motorcycle gangs, the Pagans have been able to establish and maintain widespread criminal operations despite numerous law enforcement attempts to dismantle their organization. One of the Pagans' primary criminal activities is drug trafficking. The club has been implicated in numerous large-scale drug operations, involving substances such as methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana. However, their criminal activities are not confined to drug trafficking. They have also been involved in illegal gambling, theft, extortion, and other forms of organized crime. The Pagans have a notable history of violent confrontations, both with rival motorcycle gangs and law enforcement agencies. Their feud with the Hells Angels in particular has led to several instances of violence and public disorder. One infamous incident occurred in 2002 in Long Island, New York, where a violent clash between the Pagans and the Hells Angels resulted in numerous injuries and a significant police response. The Pagans have also been the target of major law enforcement operations, underlining the seriousness of their criminal activities. In 2009, a significant operation involving multiple law enforcement agencies led to the arrest of 55 members of the Pagans on charges of drug trafficking and racketeering. However, the danger associated with the Pagans Motorcycle Club extends beyond their criminal operations. The club has demonstrated the capacity to infiltrate societal structures, corrupting legitimate businesses, manipulating legal systems, and establishing a climate of fear within their territories. This widespread influence contributes significantly to the threat they pose. Despite their notorious reputation and the efforts of law enforcement to dismantle their operations, the pagans continue to thrive. The allure of the outlaw lifestyle they represent continues to attract new members, reinforcing their enduring presence and influence. Number 5. Mongols Motorcycle Club The Mongols Motorcycle Club, characterized by their emblem of a Mongol warrior riding a motorcycle, is another formidable presence in the realm of motorcycle gangs. Founded in 1969 in Montebello, California, the Mongols have crafted a menacing reputation bolstered by their extensive involvement in criminal activities and their propensity for violence. Organized in a traditional hierarchical structure, the Mongols facilitate their criminal operations efficiently. One of their primary illicit activities is drug trafficking, particularly involving methamphetamine and cocaine. However, their criminal activities aren't limited to drug trafficking. They've also been implicated in weapon trafficking, theft, and other forms of organized crime. The Mongols have a history marked with violent confrontations, not only with rival gangs, but also with law enforcement agencies. Their long-standing feud with the Hells Angels has resulted in several significant incidents. Notable among these was the River Run Riot in 2002, where a violent confrontation between the Mongols and the Hells Angels at a casino in Laughlin, Nevada, led to multiple fatalities and numerous injuries. Law enforcement agencies have consistently targeted the Mongols, highlighting the seriousness of their criminal activities. In 2008, Operation Black Rain, an extensive federal operation, led to the arrest of 38 Mongols members on charges ranging from drug trafficking to murder. Yet another significant crackdown occurred in 2014 when the federal government attempted to strip the Mongols of their trademark logo, viewing it as a powerful symbol of their criminal enterprise. Yet, the threat posed by the Mongols extends beyond their criminal activities. They've been known to infiltrate societal structures, manipulating legal systems, corrupting legitimate businesses, and instilling fear in the communities where they operate. This ability to wield influence and incite fear, combined with their criminal operations, underlines the significant danger they represent. Despite their notorious reputation and frequent clashes with law enforcement, the Mongols continue to persist and even thrive. The outlaw lifestyle they represent continues to draw new members, sustaining the club and its operations. Number 6. 
Vagos Motorcycle Club. Emblazoned with the emblem of Loki, the Norse god of mischief, the Vagos Motorcycle Club has firmly established its place among the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. Founded in the 1960s in San Bernardino, California, the Vagos have gained a notorious reputation due to their involvement in a range of criminal activities and their propensity for violence. Operating under a structured hierarchy similar to other motorcycle gangs, the Vagos facilitate their criminal operations in a streamlined manner. A significant part of their illicit activities involves drug trafficking, specifically with substances like methamphetamine, marijuana, and cocaine. However, their criminal involvement isn't confined to drug trafficking. They have been implicated in a variety of other criminal activities, including weapon trafficking, extortion, and theft. The Vagos have a history peppered with violent confrontations, both with rival gangs and law enforcement agencies. Their feud with the Hells Angels in particular has led to several instances of violence and public disturbances. A notable incident occurred in 2010 in Nevada where a violent confrontation between the Vagos and the Hells Angels resulted in a series of shootings and a heightened state of tension in the region. Law enforcement has consistently targeted the Vagos, underlining the severity of their criminal activities. In 2017, an operation spanning seven states led to the arrest of 23 Vagos members, with charges ranging from drug trafficking and weapon offenses to murder. However, the danger posed by the Vagos Motorcycle Club extends beyond their criminal activities. They have demonstrated a capacity to infiltrate societal structures, compromising legitimate businesses, manipulating legal systems, and instilling fear within the communities they operate in. This significant societal influence contributes to the threat they represent. In spite of their infamous reputation and law enforcement efforts to dismantle their operations, the Vagos continue to endure. The outlaw lifestyle they embody continues to attract new members, reinforcing their presence and influence. Number 7. Warlocks Motorcycle Club The Warlocks Motorcycle Club, known by their emblem of a mythical harpy, holds a notorious spot among the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. Originating in Orlando, Florida in 1967, the Warlocks have earned their infamous reputation through their extensive involvement in criminal activities and a noted history of violence. Functioning under a traditional hierarchical structure, the Warlocks orchestrate their criminal operations efficiently. A significant part of their illicit activities involves drug trafficking, particularly substances like methamphetamine, marijuana, and cocaine. However, their involvement in criminal endeavors extends beyond drug trafficking, as they have been implicated in weapon trafficking, theft, and organized crime. The Warlocks have a history marked with violent confrontations, with rival motorcycle gangs and law enforcement agencies alike. A particularly notable incident occurred in Winter Springs, Florida in 2012, where a violent encounter with another faction of the Warlocks led to several fatalities and heightened tension in the region. The Warlocks have been the focus of numerous law enforcement operations, emphasizing the seriousness of their criminal activities. In 1991, a significant operation led to the arrest and conviction of several members on charges of racketeering and drug trafficking. However, the danger represented by the Warlocks Motorcycle Club extends beyond their criminal operations. Like other motorcycle gangs, they've demonstrated an ability to infiltrate societal structures, manipulating legal systems, compromising legitimate businesses, and instilling fear in communities where they operate. This broad influence and the fear they inspire contribute substantially to their dangerous reputation. Despite their notorious standing and the continual pressure from law enforcement, the warlocks persist. Their embodiment of the outlaw lifestyle continues to draw new members, reinforcing their ongoing presence and influence. Number 8. Black Pistons Motorcycle Club Sporting a black and white emblem of a piston, the Black Pistons Motorcycle Club has made its mark as one of the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. Established in 2002 as a support club for the Outlaws Motorcycle Club, the Black Pistons have quickly built a formidable reputation for their involvement in various criminal activities and their propensity for violence. 
With a structure mirroring the traditional hierarchy of other motorcycle gangs, the Black Pistons have effectively coordinated their illicit activities. One of their key criminal involvements is drug trafficking, with substances like marijuana, methamphetamine, and cocaine being prominent. However, their criminal undertakings extend beyond drug trafficking. They've also been implicated in weapon trafficking, theft, and organized crime. Violent confrontations with rival gangs and law enforcement have been a hallmark of the Black Pistons' history. Notably, their close affiliation with the outlaws often draws them into conflicts and territorial disputes with other motorcycle gangs. This propensity for violence was highlighted in a 2014 incident in Florida, where a confrontation with the Iron Order Motorcycle Club led to a fatal shooting and subsequent tension. The Black Pistons have attracted attention from law enforcement agencies due to the severity of their criminal activities. In several instances, major operations have resulted in the arrest of multiple Black Pistons members on charges ranging from drug trafficking to assault. Yet the threat posed by the Black Pistons extends beyond their criminal endeavors. They've been known to infiltrate societal structures, manipulating legal systems, corrupting legitimate businesses, and inciting fear in the communities where they operate. This capacity to exert influence and invoke fear, combined with their criminal operations, underscores their status as a significant danger. Despite their notorious reputation and regular clashes with law enforcement, the Black Pistons continue to maintain their presence. The outlaw lifestyle they represent continues to attract new members, perpetuating their operations and influence. Number 9. Sons of Silence Sporting an emblem of an American eagle superimposed over an iron cross, the Sons of Silence Motorcycle Club has earned its spot among the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. Founded in Niwot, Colorado in 1966, the Sons of Silence have built a notorious reputation for their involvement in various criminal activities and their inclination towards violence. Running on a hierarchical structure reminiscent of other motorcycle gangs, the Sons of Silence conduct their illicit activities effectively. Their key involvement in criminal operations is drug trafficking, with substances like methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana being primary. Beyond drug trafficking, they've also been implicated in weapon trafficking, theft, and other forms of organized crime. The Sons of Silence have a history marked with violent confrontations with rival gangs and law enforcement agencies. Their contentious relationship with other motorcycle clubs often leads to violent clashes and territorial disputes. One such instance that highlighted their proclivity for violence occurred in 1999, when a major federal operation against the club uncovered a stash of explosives, suggesting plans for potential violent actions. The Sons of Silence have been a consistent target of law enforcement operations due to the severity of their criminal activities. These operations often result in multiple arrests and charges against members, ranging from drug trafficking to racketeering and assault. The danger posed by the Sons of Silence Motorcycle Club, however, extends beyond their criminal activities. They've demonstrated an ability to infiltrate societal structures, corrupting legitimate businesses, manipulating legal systems, and instilling fear in the communities they operate in. This ability to exert influence and invoke fear, combined with their criminal activities, cements their status as a significant threat. Despite their notorious standing and the continual pressure from law enforcement, the Sons of Silence continue to persist. Their embodiment of the outlaw lifestyle continues to draw in new members, reinforcing their ongoing presence and influence. Number 10. The Highwaymen The Highwaymen Motorcycle Club, bearing the emblem of a skeleton riding a motorcycle, is among the most dangerous motorcycle gangs in the United States. The Highwaymen were founded in Detroit, Michigan in 1954 and have since earned a notorious reputation due to their extensive involvement in a wide range of criminal activities and their marked propensity for violence. The Highwaymen, organized under a hierarchical structure common to many motorcycle gangs, conduct their illicit activities with efficiency. Their primary criminal operations involve drug trafficking, mainly substances like methamphetamine, cocaine, and marijuana. Beyond drug trafficking, the club has also been implicated in a variety of other criminal activities, including weapon trafficking, theft, and organized crime. 
The highwaymen have a history fraught with violent confrontations involving rival motorcycle clubs and law enforcement agencies. Their deep-rooted territorial disputes and conflicts often lead to violent incidents and public disturbances. A notable instance of such violence occurred in 2007 when a large-scale federal operation against the club led to the arrest of 40 members on charges including racketeering, murder for hire, assault, police corruption, and cocaine trafficking. Law enforcement agencies have consistently targeted the highwaymen due to the severity of their criminal activities. These operations often result in numerous arrests and charges against members for a range of offenses, including drug trafficking, racketeering, and assault. However, the threat posed by the Highwaymen Motorcycle Club extends beyond their criminal operations. They've demonstrated a capacity to infiltrate societal structures, manipulate legal systems, compromise legitimate businesses, and instill fear in the communities they operate in. This ability to exert influence and invoke fear, combined with their criminal activities, accentuates their status as a significant danger. Despite their notorious reputation and regular clashes with law enforcement, the highwaymen maintain their presence and influence. The outlaw lifestyle they represent continues to draw new members, perpetuating the gang and its operations.